Thank you for joining me. In this video, I will show you how to do protocol conversion using Red Lion's Crimson 3 software and our Data Station Plus. In this example, we'll say we have an Allen Bradley PLC that only has an RS-232 port, and we want to expose that information as Modbus over Ethernet to a SCADA system running Modbus TCP IP. For our purpose here, we'll assume the SCADA is the master, so we want our Ethernet port on the Data Station to be a Modbus slave. So the first thing we want to do when we open the software is go up to the file menu and do a new and we will select data station plus and I'll select a GT version and say OK. Now our Allen Bradley device that we talked about has a 232 port so we will connect that to our 232 port. So I highlight the 232 port there in the tree and then I use the driver picker, select Allen Bradley, and we'll leave it at DF1 Master for our purpose here, and say OK. That gives me a device in this tree over here. If I highlight that device and hit F2, that allows me to rename that device. So I'll call that AB so that it makes sense to us. Now I'm going to go down and highlight the network and enable the Ethernet port. We'll say we're going to give it a manual configuration. There's its IP address. You can change that if you like. And under protocol 1, again, we'll use the pick button. And this is where we want our Ethernet port to look like a Modbus slave. So I will select Modbus TCP IP slave and say OK. Again, we have a device. I highlight that device, hit F2 and rename it. I will rename that MB slave. Now we do our protocol conversion with gateway blocks. So I can add a gateway block, highlight block 1, and what we're talking about here is a block of addresses. And our Ethernet port is going to look like a Modbus device. So I will select registers with the prefix of 4, which gives me the 400,000 set of registers, and say OK. Block size, it wants to know how many consecutive addresses am I going to make. Let's make it 16. Say OK. And in this tree over on the left, I get a block of 16 Modbus registers. Now there's nothing mapped to those registers yet, so I highlight 400,001 and it gives me a mapping tree. And over here on the right is my Allen Bradley device. If I expand that, here are all the things that I can expect to see inside an Allen Bradley PLC. And I'm going to say that I'm going to map those to integers. So I select integers, click and drag that over to 400,001 and drop it. And it tells me, well, those start at N70. And I'm going to let it there for our purpose here say OK. We'll do 16 in a row and it maps all the Allen Bradley integer registers, 16 of them, over to the Modbus registers. Now when the SCADA system comes into the Ethernet port and says give me what's in 400,008, it's going to get what's in the Allen Bradley N77. Now to be clear, we just did serial to Ethernet, but it can also be protocol conversion between serial and serial devices, serial to Ethernet like we just did, or Ethernet to Ethernet. And that is protocol conversion using Crimson 3 and a Red Lion Data Station Plus.